1998. With ProtoWeb, you can browse internet just like in 90s or early 2000s. There is lots of archived web websites in here. So, like, you can go to Google and do a web, web search and that will take you to results that's, that are indexed in 90s or 2000s. So, as you can see, we can enter sites. They are working. This is the MSN. And also we can try comment search, which is which was very popular in back in the day. That's right. Wow. And as you can see, we are in the first version of Valve's site you can go to CNN and there's live content in here you can play games like RuneScape and there's Reuters that is that will be the recent news As you can see, it's it's recent. You can take a weather forecast from your retro machine if you like, but I think it's only USA. So if you are if you are outside USA, you cannot get the weather info. And there are FTP sites in here. You can you can find various software for your retro machine. Like let's try cost to cost. And you have games. Maybe you want to download some games. Blizzard. Let's see what's in there. Yeah, Warcraft. You can download games in here. You can download software for Windows 95, 98. It's a pretty useful addition to your retro machine. If you want to use it in 2025, you can use it in this way. You can go Wikipedia. I think this is the recent site. Let's let's search something. Let's search Google. It is kind of slow, slow, but. Yeah, here we are. And this is one of my favorites. If you know Club Penguin, this is the first version of Club Penguin. And it's it's live so I don't think there's someone but but you can see people in here so it's it's a it's live but no one plays it yeah this was the first version of Club Penguin
And yeah, this is the proto web. Thank you for watching.